What's going on you guys? This is Young Investor here back with you with another video. Now, for this video, I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to automate certain things, okay? Now, I know you get tired of putting certain levels. Just like we automated the previous day close or stock close at the previous day, we can now automate. We can automate basically anything. But basically, automate means to actually draw them levels every morning. It's already there for you automatically. All right, so that's exactly what we did with the previous day close. Now we don't gotta never draw this level again. I got this in the video. You can go find it on my YouTube page. All right, and now I'm about to show you how to automate the preview market high and a pre market low as one indicator. All right, first thing first, we're gonna remove this. All right, now I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do this. All right, first thing first, let's go get the coding. I'm gonna go to the Discord. And now we're going to copy this code in that my guy David sent me, which is excellent. And now we're going to pull it back up and go swim. Now, next, we're going to go up here to set up. Hold on one second, you guys. Um, that okay. Sorry about that. All right, we're going to continue the video. All right, go right up here to set up. Go to open shared item. And now you want to paste this. Sometimes it'll let you right click and paste. So you can also hit control V to paste. And then you hit preview. And it's going to show you the code and works. And then you hit open. And then you rename it. You put it pre market 122. It's up to you. All right. And then we go up here to studies. Go to edit studies. Type it in pre 122. All right. Then we're going to add, select it. And then we're going to come over here and apply it. You can apply it, but the only thing is it got a bunch of levels. We don't want all we don't want all these lines here, right? So the first thing first we're going to do is, excuse me, first thing first we're going to do, we're going to click over here at the little toolbox, tool, toolbar thingy right here, right? And then we're only going to keep these two. These are the only two one ones. This is pre-market high, pre-market low. We're going to take off this one so you can click show plot, take off all these, all right? And now we're just gonna keep these two. Now I don't like this. So I this is your preference. I changed mine to these little lines. I'm gonna change it on both. And I also don't like the color. So I'm gonna put mine on green. Do it on both. That's up to you. The colors and stuff like that. And, and the draw the, the, the type of style you want. That's up to you. Then we just hit OK. And then we hit apply. And then you hit OK. Alright, and then we never gotta draw a pre-market high or pre-market low again. We automate things so we don't gotta do them. And as you can see. Pre-market high always act as a resistance or a support if it push past it and come back down. As you can see on SPY, I'm not going to show you guys exactly, but you can just test it out and you can see that you don't never gotta you don't ever gotta you know worry about drawing the pre-market high, pre-market low again. It acts as a resistance sometimes and it also can act as a support. All right, pre-market high, pre-market low, just like we automated the um, previous day close. You can go find both of these videos. You can go find a video on a pre, pre um, previous day close on my YouTube channel and now. This is another great automated automated video for the pre-market high, pre-market low. I hope you guys enjoy and take advantage of this. It's awesome. Awesome indicator. Have a good day, you guys.